First of all, police do not believe the victims were targeted. They do think, however, that they were at the wrong place at the wrong time. Thank goodness no one was really hurt and that they have the video. It was the end of a fun Saturday night. They had gone to a party. We were uh, coming back to the house. We'd taken a car home. As they said their goodbyes, someone came out of the shadow. Get against the wall. Get against the wall. This wall over here. The three friends do not want their names used for safety reasons. For this story, we're calling him Derek. We just thought it was somebody who was maybe asking for directions or asking for money. Uh, then we saw the gun, and we realized that uh, it was a, a whole different situation. Take off your wallet. And take off your ring. Yeah, I'm you. Give me your purse. Throw it behind me. Give me my wallet. Give me your ring. Give me all of it. The gunman seemed nervous. He said he meant business. Don't turn around. If you turn around, I'm shooting your leg. This shooting way. me my leg. I was like somewhat relieved if that's the worst case scenario. Uh, on the other hand, it seemed like it was probably more likely that he was going to shoot me if he said he was going to shoot me in the leg. The gunman took their valuables and sped away in his getaway car. He just like threw me into the ground. Like right, actually right. We're standing here. Then... Derek skinned his knee and scraped his thumb. Fortunately, that was the extent of the injuries. Police Captain Jack Hart was amazed at the quality of the video and audio. Because the quality is so great and the availability of video is so great, uh, we are finding that so many of these cases are more solvable now. Well, let's take another look at that video. We've blown it up and stopped it so you can take a closer look at that suspect. Now, San Francisco police are hoping someone will recognize them, call the police, and hopefully that'll lead to an arrest. Uh, back live, we've posted the video on abc7news.com. We have also pushed it out through our ABC7 social pages. Let's hope it makes a difference.